Alright, what's up everyone? We're moving on to the next Mario hack. This is Panic and the Mushroom Kingdom, where I hope the story is uh, more than a Goomba attacking a flower. But we will see. And apparently this is a, uh, a hack where we play as Luigi. Yeah, we already won the game. I hear some victory music. Hey, I can walk here. What's going on? Look at me. Oh my god. Thank you. Wow. You're welcome. Oh, thanks, Luigi. Bowser had kidnapped your brother. Please help Mario. Alright, gee, thanks. Look how Luigi's just, like, facing the screen, man. He's ready to go. He's ready to rip some Goomba's heads off. Alright. So, uh... Alright, custom overworld. Yoshi's home. Let's go there. Apparently this hack has some weird things in it. I'm... I'm obligated to warn you beforehand, and I got him like, there's some things in here that supposedly are not, like, YouTube appropriate, so I have to... Yeah, see? <laughs> Hola, I'm not at home. I'm searching for some good ganja. If you find some, let me know. Yeah, I'll, I'll tell him after I finish this video. But, um... The, uh... Yeah, there's some things in here that are apparently a little bit risque, so I have to make sure not to, uh, violate YouTube's guidelines as we play Jungle Island 1. Wow, that was a fail. <laughs> and I just hit the, uh, load state button before I even saved. If I had to save state during the intro, well, which I've done it before, so I can't really say anything. Alright, looks like we have a, uh, some Super Mario 3 stuff going on here. I'm digging this background, too, man. This is, uh... Oh, hey, it looks like a, uh, a subcon mass coin, or a phanto coin. Hup! Hey, is there anything up here? Hey, there is. Hey, it's just a coin. Leap of faith! Leap of success. Nice. Oh boy. Alright, now, I'm probably gonna have to be small to get under here, aren't I? No, I'm not. Nice. I really like the Super Mario Brothers 3 sprites. I, I, for some reason, I just think they look better. I guess that's my halfway point. I, think that, I just think they look better than the Super Mario World sprites, but to each their own. Wow, these Leap of Faiths are actually turning out pretty good for me. So how's everyone's day going? Mine is actually pretty good. Didn't have anything due today. I, uh... Actually, it was nice to fall asleep last night and be like, yeah, I am totally not turning on an alarm clock because I'm going to sleep until I dang well please. I am just going to freaking hibernate. Like, I slept for like, uh, probably like nine, ten hours. It, it was awesome. Like, it was so great to just get some sleep and not have to worry about rolling out of bed at the, uh, at the butt crack of dawn, which is never fun to do, but, you know, you got to do what you got to do, but... You know, I savor it when I get the chance to sleep late, so... Just felt good to stay up late. Was recording music, I was playing like a bunch of Left 4 Dead 2. Just because my friends wanted to play and I was like, okay, sure, whatever. And, uh, was watching some UFC. Hey, a blue turtle. Watching some, uh, Who's Line and all this stuff. It was, I don't know, it was just good times. Then, I was talking to this one girl, man, like, she like she's like a, um... A really, really, like, talented photographer. And I just uh, sent her a message, I'm like, you know, hey, I love your work. She's like, hey, thanks, you know, are you a photographer? And I'm like, well, you know, I, uh, I take pictures of girls when they're not looking. No, I didn't really say that, but I was like, um, yeah, I'm, I am an artist, so to speak. You know, I draw, but music's my real strong point. And she's like, you know, you should let me hear some of your music sometime. And I'm like, definitely. So, you know, I'll show her my work sometime. Okay, the TV just went out. There goes my background noise. Well, I have background noise now, but it's just, sounds like... <laughs> Yeah, so enjoy that. <coughs> Alright, this guy... This guy... Has got some pretty decent design so far. Me gusta. Oh, apparently I've been saying me gusta in the past uh, few times I've said that, but it's apparently pronounced me gusta. So I'm sorry to any uh, people who speak that language natively that I have offended, or I'm sorry to anyone who is a uh, big fan of memes who I have offended. So, oh boy. Look at me. I you cannot touch me! Oh boy. Aw, oh, he touched me. You bastard. I don't like to be touched. I'm calling the freaking, um... There's gotta be some kind of board that you can go to when someone touches you inappropriately. Uh, oh well. Guess I'll just have to put up with it. Aw. I'm a man, so of course no one can harass me or do anything to me. That only happens to women. Uh, okay, come on now, man. Alright, I am just... The timing of Bullet Bill launchers is something that I have never been able to become accustomed to, but I suppose I will have to learn. 
Alright, is it, is it storming at- no, I thought it might have been storming outside, and that was the reason the TV went out, but... <sighs> I get- the, the TV free- I swear to god, man, anytime someone, like, leans up against the telephone pole here, everything goes out. Like, that might be a bit of an exaggeration, but it's still ridiculous. Okay, this is a secret level, and it looks like the secret may lead me down to the water. But, um, we'll see what happens, but yeah. This place, man, I swear to god, like, every time someone leans up against a telephone pole, the phone, or the television, or the electricity goes out, that was brilliant. Like, every time someone freaking pisses on the ground, it floods. It's stupid. <sighs> but, someday I'll live in a great place where the sun is always shining and the air smells like warm root beer and the towels are oh so fluffy. No one is gonna get that reference without Google. Like, no one. Man, that was back... When I first started listening to that music, my friend was like, Okay, why can't I'm trying to do something fancy here. The combination of me trying to do something fancy, me being a horrible Mario player, and slow down is not helping me. But yeah, my friend was into that type of music really, really big back into the day. And he just freaking, like... At first I was like, Oh man, this is lame, this is stupid, this sucks. But then I listened to it, I'm like, man, this crap is hilarious. It's gone downhill in the past few years, I'm gonna be honest, but like, you know, that genre is still, still, it's always around when you need a good laugh, so, oh, just a stupid coin, I'm taking the shell, I am taking your house, I am the government, I am repossessing anything, wow, I can't even, I am repossess, look at that, <laughs> wow, you can just jump right off the edge of the world, but I am the government, I am repossessing anything I feel like, because I act outside of the constitution, and I have lapdogs like Perry and Romney to do my bidding. Stupid government. Okay, we didn't find the secret, which I'm not too worried about. Now we'll play Ghost Cave, which does not look like a cave at all. Did we win? Hey, it's victory music. Why is there victory music playing when I'm going into a ghost house? Okay, and why did I go in- Wait, I just went into like a ghost house and now I'm outside. This makes no sense whatsoever. And there's like, oh boy. And there's like, oh man, I just got on there. Pay attention, Axe, pay attention. And there's like fortress music playing. What is going on? Okay. Where's this background from? Is this from like, ghoul, ghosts and goblins, ghouls and goblins, ghosts and the gobbledygooker or whatever? Okay, apparently here's the cave portion of the level. Ah! Alright, now. Oh, th clearly thought I spin jumped there, but... I guess I was sorely mistaken, and paid for it dearly. Alright. So yeah, last night we were just playing like a bunch of freaking Left 4 Dead. Like, had, um... Playing Left 4 Dead too, but it had like a whole mis mismash of- Mishmash of characters. Why can't I say that properly? It was a whole mix-up of characters. We had like Ellis in, but then we had Zoe in too, and... I think Francis was in, and Coach was in. It was just like a- It was hilarious, and like me and three friends were playing. I'm probably gonna do those campaigns single-player just because, but like... Man, it was so funny. Like, I, I got the ninja sword and I kept hitting, uh, hitting people with it. And, like, they were freaking like, dude, stop it! And then, like, I was trying to rack up melee kills and they would always shoot the zombie right before I would get to it to melee it. And I was like, they were like, dude, we're protecting you. And I'm like, dude, I got this. Just, you know, let me kill zombies. I'm a black belt in zombie jitsu, a martial art which I made up to fend off zombies. Wow, we were already in the desert. Death Desert 1. You can make any level sound really cool and brutal if you put the word death in front of it. Like, seriously, like, Death Mushroom House. Wow, that was weird. Death Mushroom House, Death Bonus Game, Death Tutorial, Yoshi's House of Death, anything, whoa, anything like that. But, yeah. So, nice. Slow down did not hinder me. Seems a P-Switch would... So, anyway. But, um... Wow. I c what? Did anyone see that? I clearly, clearly jumped on that thing. Clearly jumped right on top of it. Okay, I did not jump on top of that, though, so I deserved that, but look at that. Wow, I'm c Okay, maybe I was off to the side by, like, a millimeter. L look at that. I am cl Okay, I am clearly jumping on that. Like, that hitbox is just ridiculously skewed. Remember that one hack I faced, like, a freaking... Boom boom, and it had the smallest hitbox I've ever seen. Like, I was jumping, like, right next to it, and I, I wasn't even getting hurt. It was epic, it was great. It was, uh, 
a hack apparently made for the special needs Mario player like myself. Which is, uh, you know, m many, many thanks for that, you know. We, uh, we, we bad video game players need, uh, we need, uh, video games too, you know. We need games that we can succeed at. Because, uh, as everyone knows, I'm like the only person ever who, who dies in video, okay, this, I'm like the only person ever who dies in video games, like, they, they put checkpoint systems and, like, retries and, like, extra health packs and extra weapons and stuff in there just for me because, see, see that, see, that would have never happened to any other player in the world, J just me. Oh, boy. Okay. But yeah, it's just, it's just me. Okay, holy slow down, Batman. Woohoo! You just got got, fool. Just ran right under you. And just almost knocked my microphone down. Look at him chasing me. Oh, is he gonna get me? Is he gonna get me? Is he gonna get me? Aw, oh, you fail. Alright, so, um, that'll do it for this video. And when we come back, we will take on Death Desert 2. What a surprise.